13 Warning High Blood Sugar Signs Mostly Ignored According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, 7.2 million Americans have diabetes, and most of them don't even know till they develop severe symptoms. It could be you. Scary, right? But don't worry, as there are several warning signs you can watch for that may mean you have a high blood sugar level and should be cautious to avoid diabetes. If you pay attention to these warning signs and see a doctor as soon as possible, you can help prevent developing full-blown type 2 diabetes or even manage the condition and reverse it. In today's video, we will show you the 13 warning high blood sugar signs mostly ignored. Number 1. Increased Thirst Increased thirst is one of the classic high blood sugar symptoms. There's a reason for this. Your body is trying to wash the excess blood sugar, also called blood glucose, out of your system. Your body needs more fluids to wash the glucose out, so you become thirsty and drink more. It is a notable symptom because the thirst felt by a diabetic is quite extraordinary. It is not like taking one or two glasses of water on a hot day. Instead, the diabetic is seen every time now and then opening the water jug and emptying with a devilish thirst. Do you find this video interesting so far? Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button and ring the notification bell if you want to see more content like this. Number 2. Frequent Urination Another classic symptom is having to urinate almost as frequently as you get something to drink. This only makes sense since you're taking so much fluid in. Another reason is, since your blood sugar levels are high and the body is unable to absorb them, the kidneys have to work extra hard to remove the excess sugar from the system, and in this process, they produce more urine. Though frequent urination could be due to more caffeine intake or drinking more water on a hot summer day, but if you are making more than 4-7 to seven bathroom trips even after limiting the caffeine intake, it is a red flag. Number 3. Fatigue or Tired Fatigue can be a symptom of so many things, even of not getting enough sleep. But if you are thirsty and urinate more frequently, then feeling tired might well be associated with high blood sugar symptoms. The reason for fatigue from high blood sugar is because the blood sugar isn't going into your cells where you need it for energy. Your cells need glucose for energy to grow and heal, but the glucose isn't moving into the cells. It's staying in your bloodstream, making you deprived of energy, which results in tiredness and early fatigue. Number 4. Blurred Vision High blood sugar over time can affect your blood vessels. Some of the most easily affected blood vessels are in your eyes. If your vision changes or becomes blurry for no specific reason, you should see an eye doctor. But don't panic, as it could be a temporary problem, as high blood sugar levels cause the lens of the eye to swell due to water retention, and it could go back to normal once the blood sugar levels become stable. Number 5. Emotional Instability I don't mean the onset of personality disorders or anything like that, but the fatigue that results from high blood sugar is not limited to physical fatigue. It can affect how you feel day to day. You can become irritable and touchy, or emotionally tired and lackadaisical. You may not care as much about things, or even people that you ordinarily would feel strongly about, because your blood sugar levels greatly impact how you feel, and poor management can result in frequent mood swings. Number 6. Nausea, Vomiting, Confusion, and More These seemingly disparate symptoms are all signs of a rare and life-threatening state called diabetic ketoacidosis, DKA. DKA can cause the symptoms above as well as stomach pain, trouble breathing, dry or flushed skin, fruity smelling breath, and difficulty paying attention. Unable to use the sugar in the blood for energy without insulin, the liver begins to break down body fat into a type of fuel called ketones at such a high rate that they become toxic and make the blood acidic, the US National Library of Medicine explains. DKA can be fatal if left untreated, so anyone experiencing these symptoms should seek care immediately. Number 7. Recurrent Infections According to the CDC, consistently elevated blood sugar levels can weaken the body's immune response. This makes it harder for your body to fight off some infections, making them more frequent, lingering, and serious. National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases 
NIDDK, indicates that the rate of yeast infections in women with diabetes is high because yeast feeds on sugar and excess sugar level can cause yeast to overgrow, which results in infections, commonly in the vaginal area. According to the CDC, women with diabetes are also more prone to UTIs. Number 8. Slow Healing Sores High blood sugar levels can affect your body's circulatory system. As the circulation slows down, the body's ability to heal itself also gets affected as the cells need a proper supply of nutrients and oxygen for healing purposes. Sores that take a while to heal, often on the feet, are a common sign of this decreased circulation, according to the Mayo Clinic. Number 9. Dental Issues Glucose is present in your saliva as well as your blood. When there's too much of it, it helps harmful bacteria in your mouth grow and combine with food particles to create plaque. The National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases NIDDK, explains. This leads to issues like tooth decay, cavities, gingivitis, gum disease, and bad breath. Swollen, tender, and bleeding gums are one of the first things to look out for. Number 10. Tingling Hands and Feet over the years, having too much glucose in the blood can begin to impact nerve function and eventually cause nerve damage, called neuropathy. It is because blood vessels supplying nutrients to the nerves get damaged by high glucose, resulting in decreased supply of essential nutrients to the nerves. The most common kind of neuropathy is peripheral, according to the NIDDK, which affects the extremities. You might start noticing feelings of tingling, numbness, or burning in your hands, feet, arms, and legs. Number 11. Skin Wounds Not Healing Another symptom of blood glucose is the slow healing of wounds and infections. As the sugar increases in the blood vessels, the density of the blood increases. The thick blood cannot pass through the fine capillaries to heal the wounds. Cuts and wounds at the feet of the diabetic take a longer time to heal, sometimes leading to amputation and gangrene in severe cases. Number 12. Sudden Weight Loss The reason for this can be the same thing that causes you to feel fatigued. Glucose is not getting into your cells for energy. Your body has to get energy from somewhere, so you start to burn fat for energy. Burning fat instead of glucose for energy not only makes you lose weight, but it also produces toxic byproducts known as ketones. If your body is producing ketones, you are in the state of ketosis. The signs of DKA include a flushed appearance, dehydration, exhaustion, shock, and eventual unconsciousness. Severe DKA requires immediate and expert medical care. If you are experiencing these symptoms, then see your doctor right away. Number 13. Increased Hunger Excessive hunger, also known as polyphagia, is one of the most common symptoms of diabetes. Though your blood sugar levels are high, the cells are unable to access the glucose for energy needs. They remain deprived of energy. As a result, the person feels hungrier than usual, even after eating a meal. If you have noticed your appetite increases suddenly, make sure to check your blood sugar levels. So are you experiencing any of the above signs? If yes, you should definitely see your doctor as soon as you can. He can quickly check your fasting blood sugar levels and determine if further tests are needed. High blood sugar and diabetes can be treated, and you can live a full and healthy life. But the first thing to do if you are experiencing these symptoms is to see your doctor. Do you find this video informative or helpful? Let us know in the comments section below. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my future videos. Don't forget to like and share. Stay healthy!